SD Loyal are leaving the field and hitting the beach. And they want you to join them for the big win, which is keeping our beaches clean. SD Loyal's Ben Spencer and Cassie Clapp joining us this morning to discuss this more. Good morning to you both. Good morning. Thank you for having us. So glad you guys are with us here. Uh, ben, let's start with you. Tell us a little bit about this uh, big cleanup you guys have and, and people can, uh, can see you do, doing your thing out there. Surf, you're a surfer. I, didn't, I had no idea. Yeah, yeah, I'm a, I'm a bit of a surfer. Um, I, I love the beach myself. I'm there almost every day um, on the beach, in the water. So it's something that's important to me, and I know it's something that's really important to our community. Um, so to get us, you know, all together, uh, rallying for one mission, and that's clean clean beaches and oceans is, is great. So we're going to go out to three different spots to, uh, today and, and help uh, pick up some trash and, and have some fun, hopefully. Cassie, I understand uh, Rob Machado may be making an appearance or has some sort of role in all this as well. We all know him as a surfer. Yeah, absolutely. Surf legend Rob Machado is going to be up at Seaside Beach. This is actually the culmination of our three weeks of raffling off the three surfboards that Ben Morgan and Rob created. And Ben and Morgan got help from Chris Clark, of course, local shaper. So this is all to fundraise for the Rob Machado Foundation so that they can get water filtration systems in local schools. So that's why we're going out, kicking off, celebrating this raffle with a beach cleanup tonight at 5:30. Cool. Hey Ben, um, surfing and soccer. How does how does the sport of surfing help you on on the field? Um, I, I'm, I'm assuming balance is, has something to do with, with with soccer, right? I mean, you guys you guys got to be agile and you got to have that balance. Does it help at all, or is it just something fun to do on the side? Um. Yeah, there's, there's some, yeah, core and balance involved in both. But for me, it's more of a, an outlet away from soccer um, that I, you know, that I get to have fun with um, that refreshes me when I come back and play. Uh, so for me, maybe, maybe not so many similarities, but uh, I love them both. There you go. It's all about the core. I mean, in all sports, right? Uh, talk about the season real quick, Ben. Uh, looks like you guys are, what, third in the conference right now? Yeah, yeah, we, we had a tough start, but we, we really turned it around and, and got some great results lately. So we're just kind of building on that momentum and, and looking forward to uh, this Saturday, a friendly against Tijuana, and then Wednesday uh, at home again to, to OC. I uh, love that. Uh, Cassie, a little bit about how people can get involved in this. Um, is there anything people at home watching that love our loyal, uh, but also love our beaches? Anything they can do? Yeah, absolutely. Enter our raffle. It's ending tonight. So last day to enter it, sdloyal.com slash RMF for Rob Machado Foundation. Once you enter, you'll get the invite to the beach cleanups and you can hang out with Ben and Morgan and some of our teammates, maybe even see Rob up in Seaside. Oh, It'll be okay. exciting. Well, Rob or Ben, seeing any of them, I think is a big deal. Um, also a big deal, the prizes that people can get, right? I mean, what are we talking about here? Yes, so just by entering the raffle, the first 100 folks at each beach are going to get a swag bag. But then, of course, you have the opportunity to win a custom surfboard. And Ben and Morgan were so into it. They basically lived at Chris Clark's house for like two weeks as they shaped these boards. So pretty awesome to get a custom surfboard. And raffle tickets only start at 25 bucks. 25 bucks for a surfboard sounds like a pretty good trade off. <laughs> that's great. I, you can't even get one at Costco for that. So that's uh, that's, <laughs> that's very impressive. Uh, ben, your love for surfing, where'd that come from? And uh, when did you start getting on the board? Uh, so I lived in LA in 2012. So I learned to surf then and then never really got the chance to live by the ocean again in my career, uh, but would do off season surf trips with uh, some of my friends. And then obviously when I signed out here in San Diego, it was sort of the first thing I got right back into. Um, but I don't know, I just, I love being active. Um, I love being outside and it's a perfect combination of the two. Um, so it's just uh, becoming one of my yeah, passions now. I tell you, it's uh, a combination of the three, if you ask me, soccer, surfing, and a way to keep our beaches clean and, and to help out. I think that's something everyone can get on board with, right guys? Absolutely. There we go. It's a great pun. All right. Yeah, that's what they pay me the small bucks for. All right, guys. Hey, thanks so much for joining us. And uh, good luck here on, uh, on Saturday and the rest, of the rest of the way forward here, Ben. Thank you. Uh, thanks for having us. Thanks for coming on the show, guys. Thank you. Best of luck the rest of the season. We'll have you guys back on again.